Now, before I start this video, I just want to say I'm not Christian, I'm not Muslim, I'm not any religion. This is not going to be a rant about why you should follow the ways of God. But the world itself, the way we are here, we simply have one gift. At the end of the day, we're just this identity with a name. But let's say someone gave you a car. Let's say your father. Quite a nice car, like an Aston Martin or a Maserati. And he left for a few months. And during those months, or maybe even years, you treated the car like shit. You absolutely trashed it. You didn't even use it. You left it outside in the rain. And then he comes back a few months later. Let's say a year later. And he looks at the car. At once was a beautiful car. And now it's trashed. He would be pissed, right? Now, depending on what excuses you have, odds are he's still going to be mad. Oh, I've been too busy to drive it. He would not care that much. Oh, but I'm guessing you would never do this, right? So why are you not embracing God's gift to you, your body? Simply because you don't feel like it. God gifted you this body. It is your vehicle for this planet. And you have the audacity to blame your responsibilities or your mental health to why you're not taking care of it. Your health is literally your number one priority. If that is bad, then everything else is bad. If you had stage four cancer right now, would you really give a fuck about your job? Probably not. Because without your body, you cannot do anything else. I'm not here to preach you religion, but even if you don't believe in God, you have been gifted this body. Your parents created you. It is your duty to take care of it. So yeah, people might call me based as fuck for this or an asshole, but I do call people fat. Only men, because I feel like they are way more better at taking this constructive criticism. But I do it from a place of love, not from a place of putting them down. Of course, there's a huge difference between bullying people and letting people know that they have a problem with their health. And the easiest system to go by to improving your health and your body is to just do a little bit better than you are today. Do more tomorrow and then do more the day after that. If you're a couch potato, get off the couch a little bit more. If you are going for walks, go for more walks or start jogging. Eat just a little less junk food and over time that will compound. You don't need to be built like a Greek god, but you need to have a healthy body. Hate never comes from people who are genuinely ahead of you in life. Bodybuilders will never shit talk you for going into the gym for the first time. I'll never trash talk you for meditating for the first time. That doesn't happen. Don't do what's easy. Do what's right. Peace.